My name is John Hervey from Beyond Time Comics. So I have the writer with me for... Let's talk about it. Black Tiger, Hunter Hunted. And I heard this was a 10-year journey for you. So what inspired you to write the comic? Well, actually, uh, so a little over 10 years ago now, um, I had an idea for a screenplay. And I told my soon-to-be wife that I've got this idea, and it's not something that I just want to give away or just, just sell. Mm -hmm. um, I knew that it was a property I wanted to build. So I started off by writing the screenplay, and I was already working, doing some freelance work in comics. Okay. Um, so I figured, eh, you know, we'll just make our own comic book. Yeah, there's a big difference between doing freelance work writing and mm -hmm. doing a comic book soup to nuts. So we learned a lot. We made a six-issue miniseries for the book. And um, so we actually uh, published our own comics. So what inspired you to write the comics? You know, I've always had a love of comics. Mm -hmm. And... Um, I figured it was the cheapest way, truthfully, for me to be able to produce it. So, because, <laughs> uh, you know, I figured whether, no matter how big your budget is, like from a movie perspective, it's the same amount of money to make a, a comic book. So I figured we can get it produced and we can actually get it protected. And then we can kind of go from there in terms of maybe shopping. Mm -hmm. So, what inspired the plot behind this? You know, it's kind of interesting because. Um, it started off as kind of, I think, a, a, a revenge story, and then it became just kind of, as I grew, more of a redemption story. And um, so it, it was over a, a course of time, so it was a very personal journey for mm -hmm. me, too. I have to ask, it started out as a revenge story, so is there some deep, dark secret I should know about? Yeah, nothing that I can say on, <laughs> on the camera, you know, but I've been healed. Oh, that's yes. good. I mean, you are on the path to redemption yes so. yes indeed yes. thank god Relief. for that <laughs> <laughs> so are there any personal touches in the comics that people should look out for fans should be aware of you know i don't know if there are any personal touches i mean you guys did educate me with regards to easter eggs and i'm woeful that there are no easter eggs but you know what i think there are a lot of nuggets um that are in the comics uh it's a six issue series um so i hope people pick it up and, and give it a look and it ties in pretty well with the film that was that was intentional um, nothing from the film or the comics uh, are telling the exact same story and what I mean by that is that it's all additive so there are things in the film that you won't find in the comics and vice versa and it was meant to be that way you know truly transmedia so you need them put it all together to get the full picture mm -hmm.